Okay, we're walking along this nice path through these nice houses. And it's all stone and all that stuff. And down there is a river. There's the river. Uh, a general Uko river. And there's this huge building that that is. We're going to go to this monument. So that's the... Um, we're on um, Ulitsa. Uh, general Uko. But it's kind of narrow. And there's cute houses everywhere built on the side of the mountain. And we have um, Albanian standard wiring. <laughs> so we're nearly there. You reckon if that's a hotel, that's pretty amazing. Uh, some of the houses are really nice. And. Um, one was their roof was being fixed up and uh, we noticed that the actual beams that hold the roof up were just logs. Um, still with a bark on them. Well, not with a bark on them, but you know what I mean. Like round logs. But they were straight enough to form the roof. Well, vloggy vlog. After getting lost in a couple of um, turns, because I don't know if anybody in TV land has noticed, but the Google Maps app says to turn before the map says to turn. So we'll go turn right. But then it actually wants you to turn right, I don't know, like 50 meters away or something. So walking across the bridge, across that little river, across the Rijeka. And so um, the water's not moving at the moment. And this, um, this is a gigantic hotel. It's completely empty and they're totally renovating it, like inside out. Like they just kept the skeleton of the building. So that's um, pretty amazing. Uh, Parmet Nook Asnebsu Apneps. Oh, is it is it S and an U in the end and it becomes an S anyway. The Asnebs Monument. Das Denkmal der Asen Dynasty. The monument of the Asen Dynasty was dedicated to the 800 years anniversary of the rebellion against the Byzantine rule, which ended up with the liberation of Bulgaria. The composition represents the leaders of the revolt, the brothers Asen and Peter and their successors. The Tsars Kalyan and Ivan Asen III are the most glorious Tsars of the Asen Dynasty, 1185 to 1241. During their rule, Bulgaria reached high political, economic and cultural prosperity. The author of the composition is Professor Krum Damianov. And we got it in several languages. That's obviously Bulgarian. And this is German. Das ist das. Das Denkmal der Asen Dynastie wird anlass. Anlassig des 800 Jahrigen you belongs on the Ausbruch des Aufstandes for Befriedigung. Anyway, I'm not going to read that because I don't speak German. They're bigger than I thought. Okay, so I could have just easily walked up there, so I better not have to pay if I go this way. I'm a best platini kind of guy. Isn't it nice? Look at that. Leaves falling on the ground like that autumn leaf kind of look, even though it's not autumn, obviously. It's summer. Very grand looking steps. Lesnitsa, Stepanitsa, whatever they're called. Jura uh, Shesvena Galleria, Fine Arts Museum, Boris Denev Veliko Tarnova. Oh, that's a nice painting, isn't it? Just find out where Maguru is going. <sighs> Maya Jena. There she is.
Oh, we've got powerful floodlights by the look of it. Mercury arc lamps or something down the bottom. Ooh, and we've got some, um, we've got some uh, virus particles. <laughs> uh, virus particles are everywhere. Oopsie, watch out for that step. Wow, this is, I'll oh, stop saying wow. Very impressive, gigantic. So that's um, one there. And this guy goes to the top. <laughs> oh, and these are like um, lion's heads. Oh, I wonder if that's the original, or maybe that was the sculpture done more recently. Hey, Sab. I could have just walked up in this kind of thing. Like, there's even, you can see where people have walked. And then that guy wearing a different shirt came and hassled me. You know the same guy? Oh, really? Yeah, and he starts his little story. Yeah, was this here? Yeah, yeah. So, so I told him these people are my, my brothers. They're from my ancestors. I told him these are my ancestors. And I'm starting to BSing. And then he just walked away, not interested. What's he doing here? What? What? What's the? What's the? Oh, that's a horse's head. Oh, for a minute, I saw that as something else. It looked like a skeletal demon thing, but it's not. And then there's like the wow, it's mother gigantic, isn't it? Thing. Mother and baby. Oh well, that's saying this is how how Bulgaria was born or something. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Very impressive. So this is the Hotel Velika Tarnova, Veliko Tarnova, sorry. Um, and you can just see how big it is. It's all been fully renovated. So it's gonna be very exquisite when it's finished. Okay. And then there's a walk bridge, very nice looking walk bridge. Using the strength of an arch. Oh, sorry, my, um, Sunglasses hand was in the way. Yeah. So here are all the different dates, all the different things are on. So there's uh, Masha E. Mechoka, it's on the 27th of the 6th. Ato Fadi Priyana is on the 29th. Cataract Chismi is on the 6th or the 7th, etc. etc. Art Summer Stage next to Boris Denev Gallery in Rainy Weather in the Iskra Theatre. Oh, so if it's raining, so you've got um, State Puppet Theatre, uh, Marionettes, Drama, Exhibition, all different things. All different stuff, mate. Looks like they closed in those doors. Well, I don't know how they're possible. So here's this good looking dude. One of the patriarchs. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's the door. Oh, look, post. Po Postarina. X. Exos oh permanent exposition. See po postayana is is like is when you go on and on and on about something, you go postayana. So that's very close, isn't it? Permanent. Like you're permanently like if you were annoying me, I'd say postayana. Exposition. The State Art Museum. We're gonna have a look at this little and I think we will vlog out because that's very interesting. Actually, do you want to have a look in the, the cemetery? See if anybody, the famous names on there. Is that a cemetery or just pylons? 
going to show you how good I can read this Bulgarian now I've been practicing. Let me see, it says, The Ali, the creditors of Bulgaria, with a contribution to Velika Tarnova, was established by the virtue of decision number 579 of the 6th of November 1997. Oh, what do you know, this English down here. Oh, what do you know? And that's the layout. This is a little drinking fountain. N not exactly, no. Oh, let me just look at one thing, like just one famous person. You know, it's good luck to read graveyards things. Oh, I can't even read it. No, I think this just, I think they're just for show. It's a nice little fountain there. Anyway, vlog out. And on the way back up the hill, we discovered the university of Veliko Tarnova, St. Cyril and St. Methodius. And we've got the F bet in case you want to gamble the way all the money you've earned. I don't even agree. Anyway, we're, um, we discovered this other little street. And it's sort of like the Duracaster, it's narrow, narrower, and um, nice vibey about it. But it's not the time of day, it's an evening thing. But yes, it's nice. Antiques. Do they have any antiques made to order? Oh yeah, coins. Oh, this is the back of that building. They, they've got to fix it up. Or they're fixing it up. Jewelry, souvenirs. Anyway, I'm not going to take too much today. It's too hot. Anyway, you get the idea. And it goes all the way up. Right now, halfway up there, there's some hotels and things. And then the um, street goes down again. These are the summer gardens. And, oh, what have you got all this? Centre. Sarevas. Sarevat Street. This goes. Oh, this is cool. This place is great. I think with craft and art studios and you can buy things directly. Yeah. It's still got coffee shops and restaurants, but not a ridiculous amount, just the right amount. And then it's mainly craft shops. They've actually made this viewing platform, which actually gets more narrow as you go forward. So it's like an illusion. Okay. Okay, it's overhanging. This is on these little chains for people to say they love each other. Actually, it doesn't wobble. It's wobbling. I can feel it. Oh, look at that. Yeah, it's Actually, these stairs here on their own would be a bit scary to walk down. Yeah, you can feel it move. Yeah, this architect guy, he designed the top of the house like it's brand new kind of thing. But this is called the house with the monkey because um, it's got a monkey. Few moments later, I think tabbouleh with cottage cheese. Sabina's having sea bass, and I think our chippies have oregano in them today. Mmm, yum! I don't have the same as yesterday because it was so good. 